It has been a while, a long while, but I'm so I'm kind of glad to be back here at Avernum 2. And yeah, welcome to Walls for Secret Doors. Sympathists have them. That's important. Guys, it's been a while since I've recorded last. I've uploaded what videos I had, but now I'm running out of videos to upload, so let's get back into it. Last time when we served off, we had friends! Friends! There are friends behind the door. And you know, I want to go in there, guns blazing. But wait, we don't have guns. Oh well. Hi guys. That's a lot of archers. Yeah. All right. What I would like to do. Make you faster. And stronger. You're my main man. So you need to be fast. Next, what I want to do is make you faster. And apply war bladder rage to you. Now he's a hulking monstrosity that's going to kill everything. However, our good buddy Thomas here, we shoot missiles from afar. Look at him go. He's just wiping them the floor of them. I'll keep you back in the back. You're the one who's getting shot at the most. But you're pretty shielded, so you're going to be all right. Now, shh, can, shh, well, I was that chain with the apprentice mage, but okay, kill him. With haste applied and his extra damage, he's going to wipe the floor of all of them. You guys can hang back. Ow! That kind of hurt. Missed. Missed. Dead. See if anyone else pops up. No? Okay. Oh yes. The five spaces rule. Not unlike the five second rule. Which, guys, if you drop your food on the ground, don't pick it back up and eat it. Seriously, the ground is dirty and by the time your food drops there, it's already gotten germs on it. It's not a good idea. Don't do it. Anyway, Thomas, my man, you are using stone arrows. Pick your arrows up, buddy. You need them. And we don't really want any of this stuff. None of this stuff's really that. Are you missing a pair of gloves? Yeah, you are. I'll have some gloves. We're going to pick up these arrows because might as well. Why would we leave arrows on the ground? They're perfectly good. Uh, we'll get better ones later. A shield ring. That's nice. What do you have? So, use that. Please. And a healing potion. Shield ring. Shield ring is nice. In fact, let me show you the shield ring. Well, it doesn't really say, but I think what it does is it provides random blessing and lowers the damage you take. Uh, excuse me. Anyway, give you some healing and you some healing. Whoopsie! They ain't gonna come out. They're too stupid to do so. See, they'll come out. Ah, that was a dumb idea. They ain't just gonna come out. Alright. We'll fire something in. 
You guys won't come out? We'll fight, we'll put something in. And you can hide in a corner. And heal yourself, because you took some damage there. You know what I can do here is I have to kill them all in one round of attacks. Oh no! I got hit. By the way, you're all dead. Easy enough. Oh! You're alive! I didn't see you in there. You've been unlucky there, aren't you? All your friends are dead. Stealing sure pays up, huh? Actually, it does, but these guys, they don't deserve the steal. Uh, more arrows for my good buddy Thomas here. You can't carry anymore. Ooh, no, nah, no, 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 I want those. Those are iron arrows. Oh, it automatically. Um. Hang on. I think you can split them. Wait, wait, wait. I know how to do this. Control click. Take off 20 of them. Put them on the ground. Now, pick up the iron arrows. Thank you. re up the stone arrows. I think we're good. Yeah, we're good. Alright then. What's in here? Pants, cloak, nothing. What's in here? Money and a toga. And in this barrel. Garbage. Alright, we got all that. Ooh. Is that a potion on the ground? It is. You can use that. Alright. Let's make a quick save here. We're doing well, and I found when I don't save after I'm doing well, I end up getting myself killed. Hello. Funny how looking at the door closes it. All right, we got friends in here. All right, what am I gonna do? This is cheap, but it works. Haste. You. Bless you. No, he didn't sneeze. And shield you. It makes one of your wars a hulking monstrosity. Boom. Ow. Jerk. Hit me. You back up. You don't need to be healed because you're made out of action anyway. Heal you. Yeah, he's not a nice fellow. You're taking damage, so let's give you a bit of shield. Okay, you can stop that. Stop hitting my ninja. Okay, my ninja needs to do a tactical retreat here. Actually... Kill him. Shoot. Can 
you hit him. You can. Good. Heal him. You have no more magic. But he's being a moron and constantly slowing over and over again. And you kill him. Good. Ow. That was painful. Whoops. Not what I wanted. Okay. That hurt. Huh. That hurt. Herbs. Whew. Okay. You... Alright. Let's look through these scrolls. There's a scroll of Call Beast. I'll take that. I'm not sure what's here. Mm. This book sounds disappointing. It's filled with crude lichen paper scrolls, covered with the inane or bizarre scribblings of the mages that lived here. They were fascinated with the idea of summoning demons. You doubt they were that competent. Considering they were just apprentices, yeah. There's something about these people and demon summoning. There's a scroll slow. Alright. However, in regards to what they just mentioned, yes. We'll say on this slot. We'll look in this box. Very simple. Disarm it, please. Wasn't anything else. There's a barrier here. I don't know if it's the one you can pass through or not. Actually, it is. We're gonna pass through the barrier. Oh. Demons! I came through there unprepared. Reopen that slot, please. Disarm it. There are demons in there! Yay! And I don't have the health necessary to want to face them. So... This room is stacked high of crates. A few have been opened and are empty. Some are still closed. All are fairly new and undamaged. One of them has a shipping label on it. You read it. This is a shipment of arrows intended for Fort Ganre. The bandits here must have intercepted them on the way to their true inner destination. Interesting. Aha! Uh -huh. We found the arrow shipment. Alright then. Now what we have to do is go outside because we're in some pain. Um, I think I can cut over here. Yep. Cut over this way. Go down and go to the side. We're outside. Let's rest. <sighs> and we're back to full. In we go. Let's go back to the bandit slayer, shall we? There's some demons that need to be killed. There's imps. Not that tough, but still. I think there's something useful in that room. Ooh, wrong way. Going up. Yep, wrong way. Nope. This way. If I wanted to, I could wait till I had the remove barrier spell. And then did it that way. Because I don't have that spell yet. But we'll just walk through it. It doesn't hurt that much. Yeah, it's not that bad. Alright. Combat. 
They can see you. I didn't realize they could see you. Haste. Shielding. This, this small back room is rough the rooms sketched at the floor. They were not completely drawn. They explained how to summon diabolical creatures, but not how to contain them. Very bad. Very bad indeed. And yeah. I messed up. And we ended up myself getting killed. Well, when I come back, folks, I will, uh, well, first. When I come back, folks, I will continue having him too. And we'll take care of those rotten demons. Until then, folks, I'll see you guys later.